So we'll keep an eye on, because uh, everybody cares what celebrities think. Dave Chappelle is uh, talking about George Floyd on his new Netflix special. And he's saying that um, he's thanking the young people who are protesting. And he talks about his own near-death experiences. The special's name, 846, refers to the amount of time that George Floyd was pinned to the ground by uh, Officer Chauvin. But it was also the time of day that Chappelle was born. So uh, the special is available on Netflix's YouTube comedy channel called Netflix is a Joke. So if you're looking for something funny to watch this weekend, perhaps you'll check out Dave Chappelle. I will be watching on Sunday the King of Staten Island uh, with your old friend Pete Davidson. Yeah. I was thinking about maybe renting one of those big giant screens and having a showing in my backyard. Oh, uh, I was thinking about idea. doing like an outdoor drive-in slash walk-in. You know what I mean? Um, all right. So we got all kinds of celebrity talk today. Um, I believe very shortly we're going to be joined by Zen. Are we, we're not going to be joined by Zen? Zen's not going to join us. She's having update issues on, on her computer. Um, now, Frankie, on the, um, I love the interactive side of our show. I love watching the comments of people on Facebook and trying to inject them in. Jennifer Borquevas, our own in-house social worker, uh, clinical social worker, she's the head of, uh, she's a spokesperson for um, New York Parents Against um, Remote Education. Yeah, I think the founder of that group as well. I don't know if she's the founder, but I know she's a spokesperson. Um, we'll, I guess we'll get that to that in segment five now that you said that. Um, but also, um, Jennifer did put in the Facebook feed that she said, poor Nico gets tortured. Poor Nico. And again, you know, as much as I love Jen, the pandering to Nico um, to be on air, is, is, it's not authentic, I don't believe. You know what I mean? No, Every, I think it is Everybody loves Nico. Case. Because, you know, Nico, they think he's the keeper of the crypt, but he shows up for work at 1130. So me and you could take full control of the bookings anytime we want. Yeah, well, that's true. Uh, we should, you know, I'm, think, I'm taking a floating holiday on Monday, John. We should think of floating down to Atlantic City because they have now, they now have this open container law, where, since you still can't dine inside. You can dine outdoors. And we can we can drink outdoors now. I think that would be fun to do the show from the uh, like Tennessee Avenue or the Atlantic City Boardwalk on Monday. What do you think? I actually like it a lot. Um, I was thinking when you said floating holiday, I was thinking about today doing the whole show floating on a raft in my pool. Oh, because the pool is finally crystal clear. The beach club is open. We had the first ladies night the other night. We had what fun. OK, um, but I was thinking about floating in the pool. But what about um, if you can reach into your deep bag of tricks of AC contacts and see if we can do it there? You know, I can do it maybe for a few days, not just move for one day. Well, I, I mean, the problem is there are no hotels open right now. Ah, so where where would you issue. where there's would we issue. stay? All right. Well, maybe and also, I, I'd have to come back to work on Tuesday. Ah, 